Annie. Did you bring it? Did you bring the magic love potion? Shh, yes, but please do not tell Abby or anyone else that I'm giving you this potion. This is a secret agent potion that no one should know about, especially my sister. If she knew I was selling this last bottle, she will never talk to me again. Okay, okay, I didn't know it was a secret. It must really work. This is going to be so perfect. Here it is. Use it wisely and be very careful with it. Yeah, I'll be very careful, but if you wanted to be more discreet, we should have met somewhere more private. Everyone from my school hangs out here. Oh, I did not know that. It is okay. No one here knows me. You've never met Abby's friends? No, never. Never mind me. Why so many questions? Relax, Snow Queen. I really don't care. Um, are you forgetting something? Where is my cash? Oh, right. I have it, but I must first put it away. It looks like Dracula is here. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Just hand over the cash already. Look, there's a seat over there. Abby! Abby, I love you! Wait for me! Leave me alone! Go away! Talk about a plan backfiring! If it works on Spectra, it'll definitely work on Billy at the big school dance! <laughs> Abby! My love! Hi, welcome to the Silver Mug. Can I get you something? Uh, yes. I'll have the tuna sandwich, please. I'll just have the salad. Thank you. Oh, look. Tammy's here. Wonder what she's up to. Up to no good, I bet. Who's she with? I don't know. She looks kind of familiar. Oh, well. I really don't care what she's up to. So, do you like my dress for the dance? Oh, I love it. It's so beautiful. I can't wait to show you my dress. The dance is going to be so amazing. I'm going to dance all night with Jimmy. I can't wait. I can't wait for the dance. It'll be sweet revenge for what they did to me. Making me do all their chores. No one makes a fool out of me. I'll get them. Huh. Wow. You have issues. Now before I go, I need to tell you a few things about the potion and the side effects. Hey, what's up? What's happening? Are you being chased? Um, nothing. Nothing is happening. Hey, are you going out? Yeah, I'm meeting Rebecca. We're going to go see a movie. Wanna come? Uh, no thank you. I think I'll stay in the room for the rest of the night. It's been a rough day. At least for another hour. Yikes, one more hour left. One more hour for what? For things to get back to normal. Uh, uh, nothing. I'm just being silly. Um, okay. Abby, Abby, open up! Let me in! What is that? Oh no. I'll get the door. No! Don't! Oh no! Hi Abby! I missed you so much! Can I stay here? That's weird. Wow Abby, you look even more beautiful than the last time I saw you. You saw me five minutes ago. Remember you were chasing me in the halls? Please don't make me leave. When I don't see you, I feel lost. I love you, Abby. Oh, brother. You look stressed, Abby. Sit down and relax. I'll go make you some tea. No, I'm okay. Just leave me alone. Well, uh, maybe I will take the tea. Okay, I'll help you to the sofa. I don't need help to the sofa. I'm okay. Just go- Ah! Oh, no! My magic lo- I mean perfume. You broke it! Oh, I'm so sorry. I'll clean it up. No, just go. Please just go. And get me my tea. Oh yes, I'll get you a tea. I'll be back in a minute. Don't miss me too much. Yeah, right. Oh great, what am I going to do now? I need more love potion for Billy for the night of the dance. I'll call my sister. Wow, that's a lot of side effects. And weird ones too. This stuff is really strong, and it really works. Oh, hello Abby. Annie, I need more love potion. I just gave you a whole bottle. What happened? You only use a few drops. Yes, yes, I know. 
The love potion bottle fell and broke. I need another bottle. Oh, I am so sorry, sister. I don't have any more. That was the uh, last bottle. Oh, great. Just great. But you had one more bottle. That stuff is not easy to get. The special flower that is the main ingredient doesn't blossom for another five years. Okay, I got to go. Oh, I'm having a horrible day. That's weird. What is it? Never mind. I don't care. I gotta go. Nice doing business with you. How's your salad? It's very good. So, have you come up with any ideas to break up father and headmistress? Well, I was up all last night thinking, and I think I came up with a really good plan. It may even work. Oh, sorry, sister. Hello? Hey, Draculaura, it's Operetta. Oh, hey, Operetta, what's up? Well, I was just talking to headmistress, and I asked her if she was bringing a guest to the dance, and... A and what? What did she say? Tell me, tell me. Hang on, honey, I'm telling you. Well, she's thinking of bringing a guest. Oh, no. What is it? What is it? Let me finish, sugar. She was thinking of bringing a guest, but then I reminded her that it was her rule about only Skull Academy students attending the dance, so it would be unfair if she did, and she agreed. Oh, thank you so much, Operetta. You're the best. I know, sugar, I know. I'll see you later. Bye. What happened? Is everything okay? Yeah, we're good. Operetta convinced her mistress not to bring any guests like father. Cool. Could you imagine father being there? Oh, no way. I couldn't imagine. I don't want to imagine. I start screaming when I think about it. The whole night would be ruined. I wouldn't be able to dance with Claude. So tell me what your idea is. We're still doing it, right? Oh, yes. We are definitely doing it. We are going to break up father and the headmistress. Cool. Tell me. Tell me your plan. All right. So my big plan is to give father a big surprise birthday party and we invite all his ex-girlfriends. That's a great idea. Maybe we should invite headmistress over and... Of course we are. But better yet, let's make sure she overhears us talking about the party because I am definitely not going to invite her. Oh yes, that's even better. Draculaura, you're a genius. Yeah, it's a gift. What can I say? Sometimes I even surprise myself. OMG, Draculaura, you're not going to believe who just walked in. Is that Sophie from the Darby Show? No way! In our little coffee shop in Skulltown? Oh wow, she's even more beautiful in person. I love her. Me too. I have to go ask her for her autograph. Or uh, at least maybe I can touch her hair. Don't be creepy, Draculaura. Oh, hi. Wow. I just love you and your show. Can I have your autograph, Sophie? <laughs> I can't believe I'm meeting Sophie from the Darby Show. You're not, kid. I'm not Sophie. Why does everyone keep asking me that? Oh, uh, sorry. What did she say? Is she even more amazing up close? It's not her. That's not Sophie from the Darby Show. Really? Wow, she really looks like her. Well, except for the bangs. Okay, back to our plan. So, for Father's birthday next week, we're going to invite his ex-girlfriends over to the party. Headmistress will be so jealous, she will run off and never trust Father again. That's perfect, Draculaura. Nothing can go wrong. Let's go back to Skull Academy now. I miss my Jimmy. Please, darling. I just ate. Draculaura! I'm just kidding, darling. I'm just kidding. Hey, Abby. Here's your tea. Hey, what am I doing here? That's weird. Oh, and I have a really bad headache. Uh, uh, yeah, what are you doing here? This is my dorm room. Uh, maybe you came to see Rochelle, but as you can see, she is not here. Uh, yeah, right. Wow, that's weird. I don't even remember walking here. Yikes, that was close. Now I have to come up with another plan to break up Billy and Spectra. You're doing what? Rochelle, I, uh... Spectra was right. Why would you want to break them up, Abby? Don't be that type of ghoul. But it is not fair that he likes Spectra and not me. What does she have that I don't? It's not about that. You can't explain what makes someone like someone more than another person. It just happens that way. But you will find someone special too. Oh yeah? Like when? I want to go to the dance with the boy. You cannot rush it. What about Henry? He likes you. You should give him a chance. Yes, maybe you are right. I'm sorry, Rochelle. Are we still friends? Of course we are, silly. Maybe now you can give Spectra a real chance too. 
Yes, maybe you are right. Frankie, Frankie, wait up! Leave me alone, Jackson. Can't we still be friends? You were my best friend. Yeah, I was, until you messed it up. I'm so sorry, Frankie. Please forget. Just leave me alone, Jackson! <laughs> Frankie Sugar, what happened, honey? Jackson, uh, J Jackson. Jackson, what did he do now? Well, I'm gonna go give him a piece of my mind, honey, right now. No way is he gonna make you feel this way. No, Annabelle, he didn't do anything. He wants to be friends. Oh, well, he's got a lot of nerve after what he did. Why are you crying, honey? Because I still love him, Annabelle. I can't help it. <laughs> there, there, sugar. It'll be all right. Let's walk back to the dorm room. <laughs> Jackie, Laura, hey, I was just looking for you. Now you found me. What's up, Cleo? I'm going to go. Thanks for dinner, Jackie, Laura. See you girls later. Bye, darling. See you later. So, what's up, Cleo? We have to go shopping tomorrow for all the decorations for the school dance. All right, that's going to be fun. Okay, well, we'll go early so we can get it all done tomorrow. I can't wait for the dance. We have to make sure it looks amazing. After all, anything I touch ends up being amazing. Yeah, yeah, it will. I think we'll be a good team and make the lounge look fantastic. Okay, see you in the morning. Good night. <laughs> That's so funny, Maulene. The same thing happened to me. <laughs> I couldn't believe it. It was the strangest and funniest thing. Maulene, come on, let's go. Tammy's back. Yeah, okay. Sorry, Gidget. Maybe we can hang out tomorrow. That sounds fantastic, Rooney. Meow, meow. <laughs> You're so funny, too. Why are you talking to Gidget? She's really nice. Tammy wouldn't like you talking to the other ghouls. Well, she's not the boss of me. Shh. Hey, ghouls. Great news. We're all set up. I got the magic love potion for the boys. We have our dresses. Everything is falling into place perfectly. All I have to do now is get my hair done and look pretty, which isn't hard. That's great, Tammy. It's going to be epic. Remember, don't tell anyone about our plan. Those ghouls won't know what hit them when they see their boyfriends falling in love with me. It'll be so awesome. But it only lasts five hours. Yeah, trust me, five hours will cause a lot of damage. Remember, don't tell anyone about this plan, and I mean anyone. We won't tell anybody. Cleo, Jackie, Laura, and Jackie Lily will never see it coming. <laughs> Meow. That Tammy is a genius. Really? Do you really think so? Don't go soft again, sister. Tammy is our friend, and we are with her, not those other ghouls. Wow, we did great today, Jackie Laura. I think we got everything we need for the dance. Yeah, we did really well, didn't we? Hey, ghouls, how was it? Did you get everything? We sure did, Operetta. Check it out. Hallelujah. I love it. This is going to be so perfect. I'm getting so excited. Hey, ghouls. Oh, great. I was just going to ask you if you got the decorations yet. I got some snacks and drinks. Ah. What's wrong, Spectra? Oh, I have this terrible headache. I've been having this weird feeling all day. Oh, that's too bad. Hope you'll be all right for the dance. I hope so. I think I'll go back to bed. I've been having some weird flashbacks, too. You'll be alright, sugar. Just go and get some rest. I'll take care of all the rest. I can't believe this time tomorrow night we'll all be dancing away. I know. I can't wait. I have a hair appointment tomorrow. Me too. I think all the ghouls will be at the hair salon getting their hair done. I hope it won't be too busy. Well, I'm tired. It's not even noon yet and I'm starving. Well, sugar, it's not over yet. We have to decorate this lounge today. Today? Are you crazy? I have a facial and a manicure. Nope, if we're all getting our hair done tomorrow morning, who's going to decorate the lounge? Right, right. 
Though we will need some help moving all this furniture, I think we should get rid of all of it. More room for dancing. That's a great idea. I'll text Deuce and you text Claude. They can help us while they enjoy the pleasure of our company. <laughs> Bye, darling. Being with us will have to cost them today. They will have to do all the hard work. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I wish I had a boyfriend. I still really like Henry. And Abby did say no to him when he asked her to dance. Maybe this is my chance to ask him. Just don't eat the cookies. Remember the Christmas party when you fell asleep on the floor? Well, I think she passed out. Cleo. And we all agreed we would never, ever talk about that night. Ever. Again. Oh, right. Yeah, I forgot. Sorry. Well, don't worry about it this time, Draculaura. For one thing, there's no punch. I think I'll look for Henry today. Get him to know the real me. That's a great idea, Vanessa. I hope Henry likes dancing, because I'll be on the dance floor all night. Henry! Henry! Wait up! Oh, hey, Abby, what's up? If you still want to take me to the dance tomorrow, I will go with you. Yeah, for sure, that's great. I'll uh, see you tomorrow, I guess. Yes, you will. Bye, Henry. Okay, Rochelle, I took your advice. I'm going to the dance with Henry. That is great, Abby. You will both have a great time. I wish I could invite Danny to the dance. You'll be with Henry, Spectre will be with Billy. Who am I going to hang out with? You're going to hang out with all of us. I'm going to give Spectre another chance. I will hang out with you both tomorrow and the boys. I will behave, I promise. Abby, that makes me so happy. Maybe I will have a great time then. Yes, tomorrow was my chance to get Henry's attention. He just has to get to know me. I'm a wonderful person, am I not? Well, I should think you are. You're the best. Once he gets to know you, he'll fall in love with you. Why, thank you, sugar. You're so sweet. Great, you guys are here. We have lots of work to do. Uh, what are you talking about? You both are going to help your girlfriends decorate the lounge for the dance. We are? You are too sweet. Hey, perfect timing, Andy. You can help us too. Please move out all the furniture. Well, I'm kind of busy. I'm working on the playlist for the dance tomorrow. Oh yeah, I heard you were going to be the DJ. Yeah, I'm kind of nervous. Just make sure and play some cool music and you'll be fine. Yeah, sugar, and a little bit of country would be swell too. Oh, no way, Operetta. You can't dance to country music. Why, of course you can't. Ever heard of the Dosey Do? Dosey -si what? Ugh, trust me, Andy. If you don't want to embarrass yourself, don't play country music. Don't be like that, Cleo. Dracula, what do you think? Uh, well, uh, um, well, I was just thinking, you know, dance music probably would be better. Fine, just fine. Do what y'all want. It was just an idea. A little bit of country never hurt anyone. Well, I think it could really hurt us, like, for real. Alright, alright, I'm over it. Let's get this lounge looking pretty. Oh, did you buy the stars, too? Are you kidding me? We bought all the stars. It's going to look so cool tomorrow night, ghouls. It will be the best night of our lives. It's going to be so romantic. Deuce and I, you and Claude, kissing under the stars. Oh, it sure is. Wow, me thinks I really want a boyfriend. Hey, Sugar, how are you feeling today? I'm okay. Sorry, I didn't mean to cry like that. I thought it was over, Jackson. That's okay, Sugar. I'm always here for you. So what are you going to do about him? I don't know, Annabelle. I don't know what to do. What if Jackson's taking another ghoul to the dance? Or maybe he's not even going. Frankie, you gotta relax. Just put on your favorite dress and have fun at the dance. You and me are going to dance all night. Plus, it won't hurt to make Jackson a little jealous. Yeah, that's a great idea. I'm going to make him jealous. I gotta go tell Jackie Laura. Thanks, Annabelle. Oh, it's Frankie. She wants me to meet her. She needs to talk. I'll be right back. Don't take too long, Jackie Laura. Hey, what's up, Frankie? Everything okay? Yeah, yeah, everything's fine. I just wanted to talk. You know, don't worry about that, Jackson. You're probably thinking about him. I know it's going to be hard because it's the big dance tomorrow, and you are supposed to go with him, but you don't need that loser. He doesn't deserve you. When I remember that day we went to his house, and he was there with another girl, I just want to beat him up again. Oh, uh, really? Yes, I am so happy you are finally over that big jerk. 
You could do so much better. So, what was so important, Frankie? Oh, uh, nothing important. I was just wondering if I should uh, get my hair done tomorrow for the dance. Well, of course you should, Frankie. You're going to have an awesome time tomorrow. You know, there's a lot of other boys here at the school. Don't worry, they'll still have fun. They'll go together, alright? Uh, yeah, sure, that sounds great. Thanks, Dr. Laura. No problem, darling. Need to get back to the lounge. Hey, do you want to help with the decorations? Um, not right now. Maybe later. Hey, maybe in the lunchroom in an hour. We'll have lunch. Sure, okay, that sounds great. Okay, see you later. Ugh, I know Jackie Laura's right, but I can't stop thinking about Jackson. I can't help how I feel. Talking to yourself? Are you going crazy, ghoul? Oh, shut up, Tammy. Very interesting. Frankie's still in love with Jackson. How can I use this to my advantage? Oh, I know. How would Frankie feel if Jackson all of a sudden was in love with Jackie Laura? <laughs> Meow. This dance is going to be so much fun. <laughs> Hey ghouls, I'm back. Wow, I can't believe how big it is in here. Yep, you're just in time. We're just getting ready to hang these streamers. Okay, let's get this place ready, ghouls. You really think so? Oh yeah, it looks awesome. That's cool. We were supposed to meet for lunch, Jack Laura, remember? Oh, right. I'm sorry, darling, I forgot. I lost track of time. That's okay. When you didn't show up, I ate. <laughs> sorry, I was hungry. That's okay. I think we're going for lunch now. Do you girls want to go? Sorry, Jack Laura, Deuce is taking me out for lunch. I am? You are. Hey Claude, why don't you and Jackie Laura come with us? That's a great idea. Um, okay, sure, why not? You want to go too, Operetta? Nah, that's alright, I don't want to be the fifth wheel. I'll keep you company, Operetta. Why, thank you, sugar. See y'all later. Thanks for joining me at lunch, Frankie. Just want to take another look at the lounge. I wanted to ask you something, Operetta, but you have to promise me you won't tell Jackie Laura. What is it, Sugar? This sounds serious. Do you think I'm crazy if I'm still in love with Jackson? Oh, well, I'm not going to judge you, but what he did was awful. But one thing you can't explain is love. I don't know what to do, Operetta. Well, Sugar, all I can tell you is follow your heart. Hey, Henry. Hope you'll save me a dance or two tomorrow night. I don't think my date would like that. Your date? Who's going to be your date? Abby. She asked me to go with her to the dance. Well, that's just swell. Hope you all have a good time. Well, bust my buttons. I thought he wasn't going with anyone. Great, so who am I going to dance with? You can dance with me. We'll both be going to the dance without any dates. Yeah, I guess so. Don't worry, Operetta. We're going to have fun. Good night, Jimmy. See you tomorrow at the dance. Wait, I want you to pick me up, and don't forget a corsage. A corsage? Yeah, a corsage. Good night, my love. Hey, Ricky Laura. Hey, you look tired. I am, darling. I've been shopping and decorating the lounge all day. Hard work being on the dance committee. 
but I gotta say, it looks great. Awesome, I can't wait. What about our plan to break up Father and Headmistress? We have time for that. Father's birthday isn't for another couple of weeks. We know for sure he's not coming to the dance tomorrow night, so we're good. Don't worry, sister. We're gonna have an awesome time tomorrow night. It's going to be the best night of our lives. Meow, <laughs> this dance is going to be so much fun. <laughs> You're not going to like this, sister, but I returned that dress we bought. I don't like Tammy's plan of dressing like Jackie, Lauren, and Cleo. That's okay. I decided to wear something else, too. Tammy's going to kill me, but I tried the dress on last night when I took it off. I ripped it. Well, Tammy shouldn't be mad if it was an accident. Hey, ghouls, are you ready for the dance of the century? All those ghouls are going to get what's coming to them. Um, yeah, we're ready. Cool, I'm going to go get a manicure. See you ghouls later. I really hate doing this, Percy. Tammy's plan is going to mess up the dance. Don't worry, it won't mess it up for everybody. Just Jack, Laura, and her friends. Yeah, but I really like them. They're really cool. Tammy is so not cool anymore. She's just mean. We've been friends with Tammy for a long time. We can't abandon her. Yeah, I guess. Hey, Marlene, do you want to hang out with Hillary and I before the dance? Nope, sorry. She's busy helping me get ready. Let's go. Percy, that was so mean. Wow, that was weird. I can't wait for the dance tonight, Jimmy. We're going to dance all night. All night? I better put on my dancing shoes. You sure better put on your dance shoes. Well, I'm gonna go get ready. See you later, and don't forget my corsage. Oh no, I forgot the corsage. I better run to the store. Oh, it's so busy. Oh no, I hope we get out of here on time. I hope so too. Hello, we all have appointments. Will we... Hi, yes, please have a seat. We are so busy today. One of the schools is having a dance and we're overbooked. Overbooked? Uh, where are we? On a United Air flight? <laughs> That's so funny, Jack Laura. Now, if you're going to kick someone out, kick out her. <laughs> You're killing me, Dragulora. Stop. Huh? Just kidding. We will wait. Hey, Julia. Have you been waiting long? <laughs> oh no, I hope we'll get out of here in time so we can do our makeup and dress. Don't worry, Frankie. You'll be okay. I'll help you if you want. You know I love applying makeup. Thanks so much, Dragulora. You're the bestest friend anyone could have. Yeah, I know, darling. You're a great friend, too. We'll be friends forever and ever. Oh, look, it's the Monsters from School Academy. Maybe you should all go to a plastic surgeon instead of a hairdresser. That's a bitch coming from you, Shorty. Now get out of our way. Why are you getting all dolled up anyway? Dolled up? You're killing me today, Junkie Laura. Um, I'm going to a very special event. Oh, yeah? What kind of special event? You'll know soon enough. Bye, Junkie Laura. See you later. That was weird. Wonder what that was about. Cherry's a big spaz. I'm just going to go to the washroom. I'll be right back. So, Frankie, have you decided what to do about Jackson? I don't know. Am I being crazy? He did cheat on me. Well, I have to admit, yeah, you're being kind of crazy. But, honey, you gotta do you. I just can't help how I feel about Peretta. Maybe I'll ask him to dance tonight. Or maybe I'll try to make him jealous or something. Do you think he still has feelings for you? Yeah, he told me the other day, but I just ran off. I don't know what to say to him. Shh, here comes Jackie Laura. Can't believe the dance is fun tonight. That's all Cleo has been talking about. You're lucky you have a girlfriend. I wish I didn't mess things up with Frankie. Well, that's all on you. Why did you cheat on her anyways? You never talked about it. I didn't mean to hurt her. I guess I felt alone. Being in a long distance relationship wasn't easy. Nothing really happened anyways. Well, maybe you can get Frankie back. She doesn't even want to talk to me. If you really care about her, then you'll keep trying. I do really care about her, and you're right. I'm going to keep trying. I'm going to fight for her. Good for you. I'm going to try talking to her at the dance. Maybe ask her to dance or something. Hey, maybe you can help by talking to her. I don't know if I want to get involved. Just be on your best behavior. Shower her with kindness and presence. I hope it'll work. I really miss her. Oh, boo-hoo. Poor Jackson's missing Frankie. Just wait to see what I have in store for your precious Frankie and her friend Jackie Laura. 
Yikes, I better go. I want to start getting ready right now. I'm going to be the most beautiful ghoul of the dance. Meow. Watch it, ghouls. Wow, that Tammy is so mean. Yeah, she has issues, but ignore her. I can't wait for the dance tonight, Claudine. This will be my first real date with Jeremy. That's cool. I have to sneak in my boyfriend. You're doing what? Well, I'm kind of sneaking him in. He bought tickets, but he doesn't go to the school. How are you going to do that? I'm sneaking him in through the back door in the lunchroom. Shh, don't tell anyone. Hi, what can I do for you, dear? Make me look beautiful, darling. Tonight is going to be the best night of my life. 